Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a video pertaining to my hair. And it looks like this because I um, literally just got out of the shower about 30 minutes ago and I washed my hair. And um, I washed it with uh, Dove Intense Moisture Deep Plenishment for dry damaged hair. And my hair isn't damaged, but my hair tends to be very dry. So this helps. And um, like it says, a weightless moisturizer, and that's exactly what it is. Um, and then I condition it with my Pink Touch um, Triple Strength Conditioner with olive oil in it. That goes to the relaxer as well for pink smooth touch. Okay, and I left that in for about a good 10 minutes before I washed it out. Um, use my eyebrows and everything. I'm going to get ready for bed in a few, and I wanted to do this video. And mainly because a lot of people have questions about my hair. And um, you see it's dry right now. It has I have nothing on it. And um, it has like a ton of body. And uh, what I do is um, I wrap it, which I did wrap it. And um, after I wrapped it, then I blow dried it. I wrapped it with my emotions um, hair wrap formula. And I love this one because it isn't as strong as the other one. And this is the other one. So for some reason, this one right here is like a little bit stronger than this one. So this one isn't as strong, so I freaking love to use this. Um, so my hair, when it dried, it wasn't hard or anything. It was, like, really soft. And um, also, I put this. This is the um, Essence of Healthy Hair, pomegranate, um, marshmallow, yeah, and yarrow, I think that is. It's like a styling mousse. And it foams up also like wrap lotion. I put that on my sides and I put that on my back to keep it laid down when I blow dry it. I blow dry it with my Remington Hot Shot um, blow dryer. I'm telling you guys all the things I'm using because I know it's going to be questions on what was that and how did you get your hair like that. So I want to make sure I let you guys know everything that I was using. Okay, so now I'm going to be putting my Smooth Shine Hair Polishing. Um, um serum on my hair. It also has um, aloe in it. And just put in that much because it's really thick. And plus I don't want this video to be really long because I'm going to do my whole head. And um, I can't really cut the clips in this video. Okay. So once I did that, just combing my hair down. And I blow dry my hair like this, as you see the motion, with this um, brush. The motion is going, that's how I blow dry it, and I just blow dry it like that, all down. And that's how I got, you know, the look of how it is now. So now I'm just going to apply some L'Oreal Studio Line. Um, this is a... Um, heat curling spray. A lot of people never really see me use heat curling spray on my videos because I always do it prior to, you know, when I'm about to make the video. So, I don't put a lot, of course, because um, even though this is really good, it tends to um, leave like this nasty film on your hair if you put too much. So, I never put too much heat protection spray. So, just gonna start from the side. Oh, maybe I can move the mirror up now. Okay. And I'm using my Belson Pro Flat Iron. And I have the temperature on like, it's on like 350, guys. So, this isn't gonna be perfect curls. I'm just going through it really quick just to put some kind of heat to my hair. So, of course, it's going to be no fast forwarding or anything. Usually for my sides, I use my small curling iron, but I let my mom use the tiny one. And um, she left it at a hotel. So, yeah. There we go. 
I use this one. This might be a long video, you guys, but bear along with me. Maybe I can use the comb for that. Maybe I can curl the top part just a little bit more. So no matter what side I comb it to, it still has that nice bump. Okay. Where's my other comb? Here it goes. Okay, and that's another thing I like about that heat protection spray is that um it does keep your curls for a really long time. That's what I love about it. I just don't like the nasty film that it leaves behind on your hair, but that's also another reason why I don't um use that much. Now you guys are probably like, why don't you go from the bottom to the top instead of from the top to the bottom? Mommy, you didn't give video. Mm, yes, Asia. Move back, baby. Um, but this is the no, you cannot, baby. You see too much stuff in here. I need you to go sit down. But this is the way that I always curl my hair. Sometimes I do it the other way, but um, I don't know. <laughs> this way tends to work for me. And I haven't, by the way, I haven't blow dried my hair in a long time. And I haven't put heat to my hair, which is funny, in like three weeks. So, I've just been um, wrapping it with the wrap lotion. And then when it dries, I just um, comb it down and, you know, go from there. Or I do like a twist twist out or braid out is what I usually do. I haven't been putting, I need you to move back, don't do that. That's, that's what I usually do to get my style. Okay. Mm-hmm. Hey, I need you to go in there and sit down, okay? Because you're going to knock this thing down. If you don't stop, go sit down. Don't do that. Thank you. All right. So, this is the front part that I did. Because um, I also get questions on, you know, how do you curl your hair and how do you style it. And um, even though I cut it, just like some weeks ago, I still can style it the same exact way. Um, so now I'm just going to do the back, as you see. Um, I'm trying to do this really fast because I can't edit my video for time. And I'm already 8. Oh, I'm doing good. I'm 9 minutes in. This is nice. I usually don't flat iron my hair this fast. It usually take a long time, but... Um, I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> so, anywho, <laughs> I guess I'm just trying to talk through the video while I'm doing this since I can't fast forward it or um, cut some of the clips to speed it up so it won't be so long. I'm trying to get all the areas in the back this um flat of course the back is the hardest to do for me so i try to take big chunks and bump the temperature a little bit up to 375 so um it'll curl faster and tighter so when i comb it down 
it all go into place. So, but yeah, I suggest that you guys, um, really, well, you know what, never mind. I'm just going to do a review on the product. I thought about it. And I think I'll just do a review on it to tell you guys about it. It's one of the products that I just showed you guys. And I did a review on it for about a good month. So, just going to um tell you guys about it. Because I really have fallen in love with it. Especially for my hair wraps and stuff. And you guys are not going to believe how much I paid for it either. So, well let me show you. I guess I can show you how I'm doing the back. If you can even see it. Of course, I can't see what I'm doing, so bear one with me. And I did blow dry, so the hair is a bit thicker. I didn't flat wrap my hair, so. Um, takes the temperature to be a little bit more hotter. Then you know I'm more. I used to do just 250 to flat iron my hair, but like I said, because I blow dry, um, yeah, just gonna be a little bit. It has to be a little bit more hotter. And I noticed since I cut my hair the last time, the back has actually grown a whole lot. To where I have to flat iron it all the way down to the bottom just about. Like I said, I hope you guys can see this. And I'm sorry this video is so long. But I do have people wanting to know like how I style my hair. Mm -hmm. And this is the best way to do it after a wash. Okay, so I hope you guys can see it. And um, now... Now I'm going to take my comb, just comb out my curls, Mommy. I'm doing it so I can see in the mirror you guys, age of weight, okay, I'm doing the video, go sit down, please go sit down, Jesus Christ, <laughs> I'm sorry guys, Jesus, kids. She do this every time she see me about to make a video. And for the back, I don't know my other big tooth comb is, but um, sometimes I kind of rub my fingers through the back like that because I don't want to curl all my um, comb all my curls out, and I hope that looks decent. So. But this is how it looks. And you comb some this way or whatever. And style it how you might like. Or what have you. But this is it. So, um, oh, I'm going on 14 minutes. I'm sorry. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is the style again. You guys, the 360 view, how it looks. Side and back to the front. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy, and um, I'll talk to you later. Oh, also, I'm gonna have some links to the bottom. I'm gonna take pictures and put it on my Twitter. So, um, hopefully I can do that for my cell phone. So, alright. Bye.